Sadie was just another girl next door, a regular churchgoer with traditional American values. She studied hard in school and was generally known to keep to herself. Like everyone, Sadie had some private desires of her own. Something, this day in fact, sparked these unspeakable thoughts. She couldn't concentrate, knowing that only next door laid the key to her fantasy. This day, began her downfall. Tested by this recent flood of lust, Sadie almost broke the only shackles that kept her decent in the eyes of others. But no, she held on to her morals for now. Sadie wasn't like her roommates, and they didn't understand her. They were often absorbed in the latest gossips and were completely naive to her festering sexual appetite. Tonight was just another night alone for Sadie. She didn't mind though. In the privacy of her own room, she felt safe and comfortable. When she was alone, her body was free to relax. When she was alone, she was free to battle her demons. Tonight, though it was in this room that she kept her filthy fantasies, they were able to remain tucked away in the drawer. No, traditional sex just couldn't do it for her. Hey, what's been the matter lately? Oh, um, I've just been having a really tough time lately. With what? Oh, well, it's nothing. It's nothing. I'm, I'm, I'm fine. It's nothing. Okay. Her heart began to race, her pulse began to quicken. Just next door was a sight that struck a cord deep inside her. Blood raced to her pussy, moistening and engorging. She couldn't stand it, she needed to fuck. Her throbbing, forbidden lust, pounding her into submission. She had to give in, she needed the bone. Satisfaction, disgust, fear, shame, Sadie felt torn apart inside. Hey Sadie, are you okay? I'm fine. 
Okay. Another close call. She thought, why do I do this to myself? As she regained her composure. But the world was working against her. Her demons would not let her rest. As she looked out the window, desires moistened her, and Sadie needed to save her sanity. She knew this was the tipping point. She didn't know if she could handle this anymore. Have you seen my dog? Uh, no. Wait. Oh, sexy stag. All I can think of is you. I want your canine cum. Let me be your bitch. Fuck me without abandon. Pound my willing body with your ferocious dog cock. Hate my insides white, even after that. My pussy will remain wet and willing for you when you want me. What have you done? Sadie was exposed. Her world would never be the same. 